So here the HXR200 uh, in the off position. I was asked to connect a BNC, which I've connected to a um, Blackmagic 4K assist. I've actually got it going through a Blackmagic uh, SDI to HDMI just to test the HDMI out. I'll test the SDI out as well. But uh, I was asked to switch it on. Okay, so it's on now. And go into the menu and set the menu to video out. It's set to 576i. The record is set to AVC HD 72050p. It's a low res format. I've tried all the other formats as well, none of them are working with this. As you can see now, it's still connected via the BNC there at the back. And the BNC is connected there on, on the uh, SDI converter. And there is no input. No input, no source input. If I release the BNC from there and plug it in to here. And that is the input there, input. Uh, again, you can see there is no source chosen there. So to test the actual BNC connector, I have another camera, which is a Sony PXW X70, uh, which I'll switch on and I'll connect the BNC from there onto the X70. Okay, so it's on the X70 and it's going straight from the X70 into, as you can see, the SDI on the Blackmagic and it's no problem about it working. That's me playing with the camera, playing with the camera, shooting around. And if I put that now back into the SDI converter, that that works as well so there's the SDI converter and there it is and you can see it's coming through the HDMI uh, I'm not getting any output at all from on the SDI side uh, from the, this camera I am however if I switch it and take out the HDMI output I put the HDMI output into the camera so I am actually getting an HDMI, it's a cropped HDMI image uh, which shows that the, the actual output is 576i and I'm getting a 576i output on there. You can see it's 6, 625i50 PAL and it's coming in on the HDMI source but it is still not working on the SDI. If you can sort this, um, well, you need to sort it, um, and it should really be in the menu. So if you could put it into the menu system, that would be really helpful. Thank you.